Change of sport now. Manchester City have been uh, promoted back to the first division after a dramatic playoff final against Gillingham. Like Manchester United five days ago, the match had a sensational fi finish. City were 2-0 down with less than a minute of normal time to go, but scored twice in the closing moments, sending the game to extra time and penalties. And that means City back in Division 1 after a year going down. For Gillingham, this was their shot at the promised land. They've never been in the top two divisions before. For Manchester City, a chance to end their first spell out of it after just one season. 80 minutes the fans waited for a goal, then they got four in the most dramatic end to a playoff game. Carla Sabat, the first on target for Gillingham. At the other end, Vince Bartram was keeping the Jills ahead with a string of fine saves. Paul Dickoff thwarted yet again. City fans were beginning to suspect this wouldn't be their day. And five minutes later, they were two down, Asaba setting up Bob Taylor. Gillingham stood on the verge of a historic promotion. But then an extraordinary comeback from City, which rivalled that of their Manchester neighbours United in midweek. On 90 minutes, Kevin Horlock with a lifeline, Bartram finally beaten. City pushed everything forward and made it count. Dickoff, City's best player throughout, had given them another 30 minutes of extra time in which to resurrect their season. But if Gillingham was shell-shocked, they did have their chances to avoid a penalty shootout. Some tired defence putting Nicky Weaver under pressure, which he coped with. But with the game still deadlocked, the two clubs now had five kicks each to determine their whole season. And Gillingham it was who cracked Paul Smith, the first of three players to miss. Paul Dickoff was the only City player off target with the most bizarre penalty. But at 3-1 down, Guy Butters knew he had to score to keep Gillingham's dream alive. And Nicky Weaver was on hand to break their hearts. City fans were mad for it, their team back into the first division at the first attempt. Now the assault on the Premiership can begin in earnest. James Munro, Sky News, Wembley.